Hey everyone, it's Paul Bertarelli reporting from the Aircraft Electronics Show in Dallas, Texas, where ADSB isn't the only thing being talked about, but it's close. Three companies have introduced a total of six new products, and we'll take a quick look at those, and let's start with Avidyne. In addition to the AXP340, which is our 1090 ADSB out transponder, we, and we also announced an MLB100, which is a 978 ADSB in. At this show, we're announcing two new uh, UAT transceivers for ADSB in and out, one with an embedded GPS and one without. So those will be are designed to work with not only the 540 and the 440, our new GPS navcons, but also with our legacy EX series MFDs. The MLB100 is 2495. The ML X200 is $34.95 and the MLX210 which has the GPS is $49.95. Today at AEA we're introducing the Sentinel STX360. The 360 is a Mode C transponder with a UAT transceiver in and out built into it. Uh, part of the benefits of having these two things combined is that you can have a single antenna uh, with a built-in diplexer. Uh, so you only have one antenna connection to, to install. Uh, the Sentinel is somewhat unique in that it has traffic display and METARS display on the unit itself. It's a standard mark width, so it can easily replace any transponder in the center stack. Uh, and it has a Wi-Fi gateway in order to get it the data to uh, electronic devices such as iPads. The Sentinel will be available in 2016 and will be priced under $3,500. For more information, uh, please visit www.sandia.aero. At AEA, we're introducing the Stratus ESG. It's the ADSB out member of the Stratus family. Uh, it's a 1090 ES transponder with built-in WAS GPS. So it's kind of an all-in-one solution targeted directly at the legacy non-glass panel, non-GPS equipped aircraft market. Uh, the ESG can be directly connected to a Stratus 2 portable device. And what that allows you to do is mount the Stratus pretty much anywhere in the aircraft you want because now it's going to be get, getting power as well as data from the externally mounted antennas, the belly mounted ADSB antenna and the roof mounted GPS antenna. So it really takes away all of the compromises of ADSB in using a portable onto the iPad. We haven't announced availability yet. Uh, the price is $3,490 and that does include the GPS antenna in the kit. Um, you can see more information at www.apario.com.